Last season was a challenge. Um, coming off a year where we didn't play or practice, had two full classes that had never even been in a college practice. Um, so it was a lot of teaching and a lot of development. Um, but I thought as the season went on, we progressed well and we definitely played our best hockey in the second half. We brought in seven new players. Uh, we're excited about their talent, high talent class. A lot of potential for the group and we've always played a structured game, um, de heavy emphasis on the D zone, staying defensive, working it up ice from there. Uh, so the potential is there, the talent's there. With the returners, we have a solid foundation of guys and uh, can step into leadership roles and be key contributors. So with that potential with the new guys, like we have a chance to do really good things this year. There's a lot of different age groups we got on our team this year. We got guys from 03s to 98s, I believe. So we got a wide range of uh, ages on the team and different backgrounds as well. So. Uh, we come together and we just play hard. Um, that's kind of the name of our game, play hard, uh, pay attention to the little details and just kind of play with what we got. So um, that's kind of our game plan going forward. We've always been a good, disciplined, defensive team. We try to take care of small details and uh, play the game responsibly. Um, I think we have a type of group that can do that again. We're going to have our work cut out for us, scoring goals, but I like our depth. I think it could be one of our deeper teams that we've had in a while. Um, but talent is just a piece of it. The character and the chemistry and how that all evolves makes as much of a difference or more than the talent level. Yeah, we're trying to emphasize hard work and compete and building good habits. I mean, it's all about details within our program. It's preached from the coaching staff. so. Focusing on the little things, like throughout on the ice, off the ice, in the classroom, around campus, doesn't matter, details, habits, doing the little things right and not taking anything for granted and staying accountable. Well, obviously, I wouldn't be here if I didn't love Amherst and love the program. To see it evolve and develop has been fun and it's been rewarding. There have been an awful lot of really good kids and good hockey players that I've been lucky enough to, to interact with and um, that's been the best part. We're in it to win it so uh, we got our eyes on the prize. For us seniors we've never made it to NESCAC final. Um, it's one of the first groups uh, that I haven't done in a long time in Amherst hockey so we got one more year to do it so for us seniors we're gonna kind of bring that energy and just kind of transfer it to the younger guys and it's gonna be it's gonna be a fun ride for sure.